Hi there, hope you're well. Just a real quick off schedule video for you. Uh, if you saw my DIY rail hinge video, and if you didn't, it's the one that's currently playing on the channel now. Uh, if you caught that uh, last week, you'll know that I talked about the fact that it really is just plans at the moment. Those plans are in my Etsy store at 10minute.shop. And thank you so much, everybody who's picked up a set of those. Um, <sighs> I might be able to make it as a kit of parts, but before I got to that, I suggested that I might do some of the really twiddly, fiddly little bits. And that's what I've done. I've had a, a batch, a run of these made. These are the hinge pivots. They're the smallest parts uh, in the whole of the guide rail hinge and the bit that really needs to be drilled precisely. I've had these CNC'd by uh, the guy who does my CNC work on the loose tenon jigs. Uh, they come out really well. But it turns out it's really quite complicated to get very small parts cut on a big CNC, especially when there's so much precise drilling to do. And the best way to do it, we discovered, was to do them in a tile like this. So it comes like a little airfix kit held in place by tabs, which you've got to cut off. You can cut those off really easily with a plunge saw, with a track saw. Uh, if you don't have a plunge saw or track saw, I've got to ask why you're... <laughs> buying parts for a guide rail hinge. But if you haven't, uh, you can cut those off with a hand saw, a band saw, a chop saw, any kind of saw that you've got, jigsaw, any of that kind of thing will do. And then finish it up with a little bit of light sanding. I did that, they work really well. They're made from really, really nice quality birch ply and they finish up a treat. I'm doing these as a little bundle with some hardware. You've got a couple of little bits in here, some stainless steel, five mil, dowel pins that we use as the hinge pivots. They fit really beautifully. And there's a couple of uh, five millimeter clevis pins. I use those for the hinge height adjustment. Uh, they're all, they all come together, a couple, of, uh, a couple of each of those, a pair of each, so you don't need to buy a pack of 20. Uh, and those with the pivots are available in my Etsy now at 15 pounds. Uh, plus shipping to the country of your choice, of course. Go and check them out. As I say, I had one run of those made just to see if there's sufficient interest to get any more done. So they're in relatively short supply. Uh, the uh, plans are, of course, still in my Etsy. So go and check those out as well. Uh, that's it for this one, though. Thanks so much for taking a quick look at this off-schedule video. Uh, normal service will resume with the next video on Friday, I think. All right, and hopefully I'll see you then. Take care.